Students, tomorrow we will commence studying advanced potions. And the first potion will require you to obtain a very special ingredient. A dragon's tooth. Oh, wow. You mean from a dragon's mouth? A real live nasty big old fire breathing dragon's nasty mouth? That's usually where you find their teeth, yes. Well, that's not a place I really want to go near. <laughs> We do not have to. I shall obtain the item with ease with my newly perfected acquisition spell. No acquisition spells. That would be cheating. For this assignment, you are to use only your cunning and perseverance. Except that the dragon is going to be using its fire and it's more fire. So I don't see how this is going to be a fair fight. Oh, I'm sure you'll do fine, Sabrina. You're one of my most promising students. So I suspect you'll figure out how to deal with a dragon. Huh? Today, you'll be working in pairs. Sabrina, you'll be with Vera Lupa. Let's hear it for Team Vera Brina, yeah! Zanda, it'll be you and Londa. We can be Lon Zandada. And Shinji. You'll partner with Ambrose. Oh, let's hear it for Team Amshi. Hmm. Team Shimbros? Sorry. All right then, good fortune to all of you. Positions, prepare, comments! Huh? I think he means on your mark, get set, go. <laughs> Dragon's lair. I can smell it. Too bad. This is fun. <laughs> We're there. What? Where? There. Ah! What you looking at? Looks like Lon's on Data found themselves a dragon's tooth. Hey, we found it first. But we found it second and third. Why don't we pair up our two pairs, get the tooth together, and tell Professor Geist we did as a team? Okay. Okay. What are we waiting for? Let's get the tooth while they're just standing around. Or we can sit back, let them do all the hard work of getting the tooth, and then snatch it away from them. That's pretty sneaky and not completely fair. I'll take that as a compliment. Hey, look! Uh, and look! Some of its baby teeth are loose! There's enough for all of us! We could grab a few after they fall out. Sounds good to me. Let's go! The Enchantra has ordered me to mess up Sabrina's life, but I haven't even seen Sabrina today. How am I supposed to mess up a person's life if that person isn't even around to have their life messed up? <laughs> Maybe by messing with someone that person <laughs> likes instead. Oh, I know what you're thinking. Salem, you are a genius. <laughs> Couldn't have said it better myself. Hey there, little dragon fella. <laughs> hey, 
how about we let him gnaw on this? Yeah, those loose teeth will just fall right out. <gasps> Come on, boy, let's play. Uh oh, it sounds like mommy's home. Wait, what? This? Oh no 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 no! Okay, this was for chasing, not for hitting. Am I running away? I really want to be running away, but I can't tell if my legs are moving. There we go. You play with dragons, you're gonna get burned. So, run! Nah, we did that already. Where to? Back to school. But we didn't get a dragon's tooth! We'll fail the assignment! Yeah, but if the alternative is being barbecued by an angry mother dragon, I'll take the F and try to make up the grade later. None of you managed to get a dragon's tooth? Well, we found a lot of teeth, but they were kind of attached to a baby dragon. And then his mother was kind of attached to her kid. Well, I'm sorry to say we won't be able to do the advanced potion I was going to teach you. Actually, we can. Shinji, you got a dragon's tooth? I did better than that. I got a whole dragon. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? You dragon napped a baby dragon? That's low. Okay, even for you, Shinji. What's the big deal? The big deal is that you don't take kids away from their parents. We're parents away from their kids. Sabrina is right. A school like ours is no place for a dragon. And not just because they tend to be horrible at math. Well, I think you're all just jealous because I have my very own baby dragon, and you do not. What? You're keeping it? Of course I am. Having my own pet dragon will make me the most impressive warlock ever. Plus, I'll win this year's Westminster Dragon Show for sure. Get away from her! You're mine! Quite all right. A face full of snow is far better than a face full of fire. You need to be gentle with baby dragons, Shinji. If you scare them, they can get the hiccups. And sometimes after that... They run away! Huh? Where did it go? Uh, <clears throat> I don't see it. Me neither. I am going to find my dragon, then I'm going to keep my dragon, and there's nothing you can do about it, because it's my dragon! Come on, Ambrose! <gasps> it's not your dragon! Sabrina, wait! There's something you need to see. We figured if we got it out of Shinji's sight, Shinji would get out of our sight. <laughs> nice. <laughs> okay, well, let's get little Draggy back to its mother before he burns this whole place down! All right, let's go find your mommy. Whoa! Come on, Draggy, this way. Whoa, 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 wait, wait, no! <laughs> so, I guess you skipped the class on leash training, huh? your arms and dragon wings inside the ride vehicle at all times. What are you looking at? No, no, nothing to see over there. Wait, no, dragon, come back! Ah, got you. Tell me, it followed you home and you want to keep it? <laughs> OK. 
Okay, let's make this the longest jump ever. Time for my daily dose of destruction. <laughs> Whoa! Salem? Salem? What are you doing here? You can watch, but you have to do it from over here. As long as I'm close enough to mess up your life, I can at least tell Enchantra I did something today. <laughs> Watch out for that hole! <laughs> I don't remember seeing this hole before I jumped. Meow. Mother? Have you seen my new pet? Oh, you have a new pet? What is it? Where did you get it? I obtained it during a school project. It's a baby. What in which world was that? <gasps> Shinji, were you about to say baby dragon? Uh, here you go, draggy. Mm. Fill up, but then I'm taking you right back to your mommy. Mm, let me get you some milk, too. And that was a job well done. A little sand, a little magic, and presto, Enchantra is off my back for one more day. What? Salem? No, you scared it! Oh, it's okay, Draggy. It's okay. It's... It's... <laughs> Not okay. What happened? What's going on? <gasps> Look out! <laughs> Sabrina, I think it's time for you to get that dragon back to Witch World. Yeah, I will. Right away. <gasps> Where'd he go? I think he went that way. Okay, okay, let's not panic. Just because there's a fire-breathing dragon loose in Greendale. You know what? I think we should go ahead and panic. We're with ya! Dragon. I do not know. I cannot find it. Well, until we do, his mother is going to get angrier and angrier. Should we tell her? I'm not gonna tell her. But somebody probably should tell her. Tell me what? The baby dragon escaped into the human world. What? Yeah, but I'm sure Sabrina's bringing it back. Well, she had better do it quickly. The shield can only take so much more angry mother dragon fire before we're all burnt to a crisp. <laughs> If I was a baby dragon in Greendale, where would I go? Oh! I'd go over there. Did you find it yet? No, but I'm getting warmer. Everything on the down low. I got it. I don't care where you keep it, just bring it back. No cats to get in my way, no holes to fall in. This place is so much safer than school. There 
There you are, Draggy. <gasps> Hold still. I'm gonna need to come up with something bigger than a baby dragon box to put that thing in. Huh, I guess that'll do. Oh no. Oh no! What the? Whoa! Sabrina? Uh, what happened to that tree? Um, it must have been lightning. There isn't a cloud in the sky. Yeah, so that's when you least expect it. What are you doing here anyway? Just, uh, uh, looking for recyclables. Hey, look, a cardboard box. Uh, I think there's something in there. Well, if there is, I hope it's recyclable too. Where are you going now? Can't hear you! Helmet! What was that? There it is again. Oh, look out! <laughs> Whoa! What was that? It must have been something from my engine. I really need to get this thing fixed. Whenever I want to get rid of my hiccups, I drink a cup of water from the other side of the cup. Might as well give that a try. Now just drink this and everything will be fine. Uh-oh. Take cover. I think he's still got him. Maybe we should have him breathe into a paper bag. Sounds like as good of a plan as any. Not worked at all. I've got it! We'll scare him! That'll get rid of his hiccups for sure! Except that scaring him was what gave him the hiccups in the first place. So what we actually need to do is completely calm him down. Rest, little draggy, don't be scared. Think of your home back in your lair. Breathe deep in, don't breathe fire out. That's what resting's all about. I think. <gasps> yeah, it worked. <sighs> yep, that is one hiccup free baby dragon. Then he and I have somewhere to be. Where is Sabrina with that baby? The dragon's fire will break our shield at any moment. There she is. Time! Look, Draggy, it's your mommy! Dragon's Tooth. 
It was my dragon, and Sabrina stole it. So, that was your baby dragon? Yes, it was. I was the one that brought it back to witch school in the first place. Shinji, I have warned you against such things. Do you not understand how furious mothers can become if they are not treated with the respect they deserve? Yeah, that dragon was scary. <laughs> I was talking about me! Mother, why have you brought me out here, so far away from home? Oh, after your display of insolence, I felt that you needed a lesson regarding the sanctity of the relationship between a mother and her child. Oh, so this is a family outing. Time alone for mother and son? Mm-hmm. In a manner of speaking. <gasps> ah! Enjoy your lesson. Mother? Mother? 